Hello everybody, Lady B here. I hope you can hear me with all the traffic and everything. But anyhow, I am so mad I could spit nails. This is Danny's truck. And he went to wash it today. And I don't know if you can see all this, but see all the little speckles on it? Sorry about all the wiggles. Yep. Look at all the speckles on it. This is paint. Neighbor was uh, painting her porch and out of pure carelessness she painted Danny's truck too. And now we're going to have to get somebody to buff it out. We got it all the way down here. Just horrible. Yeah, I did knock on her door and tell her she would be paying for it. But anyhow, this is her porch. And she painted it. Now, I don't know if it's today or yesterday. But this is her porch. And that's what it looks like on the side. And this side is where she splattered it on Danny's truck. Sorry about all the shaking, but I am just so mad. And if I can back up a little bit, I'll show you how close Danny's truck is to her porch. She took it, or he took it to be washed today. And he came back, and he was rather angry too. And I'm sure most of you would be too. Look at this, it's horrible. So we're going to go get an estimate. Or have them come to us, either one. But we're going to get an estimate. See how much it would take to get that buffed off of there. And take my neighbor the estimate and her to write the body shop a check. No, I don't think I'll take a check. I don't know if they will or not, but she wants to make a trip out there to pay them. That's fine with me. But anyhow, this is what I'm dealing with today. And I'm also trying to get my garden ready. We've been over there working on the raised beds. But we had to quit because Danny <laughs> busted his hand. But this is what I'm doing with my little garden bed right here beside the house. I've got it ready to put in some... See, I can't put anything right there because right there is the door to the crawl space. But anyhow, I've got it ready for the uh, potatoes to go in. Grow, go in. I'm, uh, I've got them under the sink waiting for them, the eyes to grow a little bit. But that's where they're going to go. I usually put them put tomatoes in here and then now you've got hooks along the wall there with a net to keep the stupid neighbor's cats out if I don't they go in there and dig all the time but when I had tomatoes here I had to fasten them to these hooks and tie them to the whole house because a lot of times they went way up here a lot of times they went without within reach Sometimes they went out of reach. But, okay, I guess if it's, that's enough ranting for now. But, I'll let y'all know what happens. So, we'll talk to you later. And thanks for watching. Bye.